In this session, we are going to work with buttons and checkboxes. Both are web elements that require a click. However, there are times when the Selenium click method will not work on a button. If that's the case, then we must use the Selenium submit method. If you're interested in reading a document, then I created a transcript based on this video. Now, let's look at the student registration form on Tools QA Practice site. If I click the submit, then we see the required fields are first name, last name, and gender. Also, mobile number. However, we will focus on the gender radio button, the checkboxes for hobbies, and the submit button. Let's start by inspecting the female gender radio button and find the element by typing two forward slashes, label, open and closing brackets, at four, two single quotes, then the value for the four attribute, gender hyphen radio hyphen two. Bingo, we found the element. Now let's go to the IDE after copying the value. Right now, I have import statements for WebDriver, by and Chrome Driver Manager. Maximize the window has been established. Let's now load the AUT. Before loading the AUT, let's first find the element since I copied that value. Driver dot find element by XPath. The value, I'm going to paste it. I'm going to also bring this information to the next line because it's kind of long. The method we will perform for the radio button is dot click. At this point, we have found the radio button and we're clicking the radio button. Now, let me go back and copy the URL and we're going to inspect the checkboxes for hobbies when I come back after pasting the value. Now, let's inspect two of the hobbies, sports and reading. Starting with sports, we see it has a value of hobbies hyphen checkbox hyphen one. I'm going to find the value by replacing gender radio two with the pasted value and we found the element Let's also inspect reading. It has a similar value as sports. The only difference is the number changed from one to two. Therefore, I will copy this value and go back to the IDE and find the sports checkbox Java dot find element by X path and paste the value and just like the previous statement I'm going to drop it to the next line and we're going to click the checkbox do the same for the next element but change one to two now that we have found the three elements the last statement is to click the submit button by writing driver dot find element dot click. At this point, let's go back and get the value for submit. Inspect, and we see it has an ID value of submit. So driver dot find element by ID with the submit value. Now, let's run. Look at the code. The code looks nice. It looks right. Now, let's see what happens. It returned a exit code of one. Exit code of one means that execution was not a success. It's a problem. 
it's a problem because we're not supposed to use the click method on that submit button. And we go through, it has a message that says element click. It's complaining about the click method. So let's go back to the AUT. Some of the times the synonym click method does not work on a form. If I highlight this part, we see form. That means that the submit method is inside of a form. If I keep on scrolling, it will show a form tag somewhere in this application form. Now, let's change the click method to submit and see what happens. And run again. And we saw how the elements were clicked. Let me try that again so you can see how it clicked the elements. Execution goes so fast that we did not really see clearly that they were clicked. Female click, sports and radio was, buttons were clicked, sports and reading. So we saw how the click method did not work on that form. Let's go to a different application. Orange HRM and inspect this login button. We see it has a value of BTN login and it is also located inside of a form tag. Now let's go ahead and inspect the other elements because we're going to type in information and then click the login button. Username has a value of TXT username. Password has a value of txt password and we saw how login had a value of btn login now let's go to a different file and enter this information i'm going to write driver dot find element by id and the value is txt username send Keys, admin. I'm going to copy and paste this information and change admin to admin123 for txt password. And for the button, it's driver.find element by ID. And that value was btn login. And we're going to use the click method. Now I'm going to sleep it so we can see the next page load. Now let's run. The next page loaded, which means the button was click and it shows exit code zero. Now let's also use submit to see what happens and run again. The submit method works. We saw how on that page, click and submit works. I just wanted to show you that part because sometimes you may come across a situation where click does not work. That's it for working with buttons and checkboxes. And I will see you in the next session. Thank you.